So today I wanted to talk about whether I'm moving away from traditional to-do list experiences over to something a little bit more document-based. Today I wanna to take you through why I'm considering something like this and a sort of experiment that I'm going through at the moment. So welcome, if you're new here and you want to learn about productivity tools or just my opinion on stuff, then feel free to subscribe. Um, I'm talking today about how I'm considering moving to craft from Todoist. Now, um, for those who know about sort of how I use productivity apps, for many, many years I had quite a lot of apps and over time I've been shrinking them down into, I guess, more and more or less and less apps as a total experience. Um, I used Todoist and collectively for about 10 years and Sunsama for about three years in total. So those have been my two to-do list apps over the last, well, my entire career basically. Um, and now I'm considering, uh, I've been looking at sort of craft for many uh, sort of months and um, about three months ago I started writing down my to-dos inside of craft and they've also released a new task management experience. But primarily, if you look at this sort of document here, this is how I've been organizing my tasks uh, for the last three months. I've just been writing a title for priorities, adding the checklist for tasks, and essentially just adding tasks to the list. And then when I uh, organize them for the day, I typically just give it a H3, heading three at the top, and just say, you know, today's date, basically, and organizing them like that. Now, Craft has its own task management system. It has a way to add it to an inbox and add deadlines and due dates and things like that. Um, I've just sort of been doing um, so many different smaller and things that have been moving around in terms of priorities because we're sort of trying to run a startup. It, well, we are running a startup of building uh, what we're building now. And it's sort of like becoming quite overwhelming to keep managing a to-do list and organizing what day they need to be on and things like that. And at the moment, a document-based list is actually helping me more than ever. So I create this one called priorities and essentially what I do, so to keep that updated and I add any tasks that I need to down at the bottom here. So any, anything that is just additional, I put down here and then I have some lists down at the bottom that I create using the card function. Um, so here might be, this one is, say, the reading list. And I'll go into it and just change the reading list title. And I'll go back. And, and that's where I drag anything that is link-based or anything like that. The only problems I'm try I'm finding at the moment with Craft is that there's not a good way to import tasks at the moment like Todoist is. So I'm still having to rely on ways to bring it into Todoist. But largely, this seems to be working for me because it's removing any additional application. So I've been using Craft for about four or five months now as a sort of replacement to-do list experience. It's got a daily journal in there. And I think it's just nice because I'm taking things back to the basics. And when, you, I guess I'm in a very strange phase in life where I'm sort of drastically changing my task management and everything seems to be very fast moving and moving it just to a basic list has helped me massively. I think it's just taking the administrative work out of planning stuff because things are moving around so fast it, compared to a, maybe a typical job and I'm finding that this is incredibly helpful. So that's just a glimpse of my current process. I'd really love to hear whether anybody else has found this beneficial or whether they have an actual system behind it because I'm just making this structure up as I go along um, and sort of ordering the task based on importance and then dragging them around when they're not so important and things like that. So uh, I thought I'd share a little bit about how Craft is feeling like it's becoming my to-do list experience, uh, which is strange enough. It's past the three month mark now, and I feel largely more productive than I was using Todoist, which is strange. But maybe that's because I'm consolidating. Collectively, I'm just using Craft, superhuman. I'm trying to look at the apps on my screen. I've eradicated Notion, apart from one thing that I do in day in there, which is still in there, which is payment stuff. And that's practically it. It's really weird because like condensing this in one, like craft being notes, to-dos, not calendar obviously, is strange. So it's almost like I have a calendar app and then a all-in-one system at the moment. So an interesting one, I thought I'd share it uh, as I go through my journey with it. Um, and if you have any comments on how or whether you've done something like this, it'd be really interesting to hear. So I'll be reading those and uh, looking forward to seeing whether you're using those. So I'll see you in a future video, and um, uh, I'll see you around. Cheerio.